Hello, I'm Janae Tipsharani with 90 at 9 brought to you by interest.co.nz. This is where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock with news of a weakening dollar. But first, manufacturing activity has weakened in China and Japan in April, while growth in the sector has slowed in Europe and the US, suggesting the global economy may be less robust than policymakers are predicting. Overall, manufacturing in the US is still going strong, despite new export orders falling and domestic orders in China and Japan dropping right off. As for the sale of new houses in the US, growth is soft. While March saw a double-digit increase in sales compared to March last year, the number of houses being sold is still below market expectations. US and British authorities have fined Deutsche Bank a record $2.5 billion to settle accusations it helped manipulate the benchmarks used to set interest rates on trillions of dollars in mortgages, student loans, credit cards and other debt. Back home, there's considerable horsepower across the economy's engines. The ANZ Roy Morgan Consumer Confidence Index nudged up marginally in April as consumer sentiment was perky, businesses were optimistic and inflation expectations continued to ease. The US Treasury 10-year benchmark yield is unchanged today at 1.97%. Swap rates have fallen with a steepening bias following the Reserve Bank Assistant Governor John McDermott yesterday announcing an OCR cut is possible if wage and price setting pressures settle at lower levels. The US oil price has risen 58 US dollars a barrel, while Brent crude has crept up to 65 US dollars a barrel. The gold price remains at $1,188 US dollars an ounce, following a big price drop yesterday. The New Zealand dollar's dropped to the lowest point it's been in a week, once again a reaction to McDermott's game-changing speech. Overnight, the dollar fell against the US to 75.9 US cents, the Australian to 97.5 Australian cents, and the Euro to 70 Euro cents. The TWI fell 100 basis points to 80.4. I'm Janae Tipsharani, and that was 90 at 9, brought to you by interest.co.nz.